Hey guys, I'm Jordan from Norwich Camping and Leisure and we're beside the new Napoleon Rogues for 2021. Um, these are some of the best uh, entry level grills uh, out there on the market, um, so from Napoleon. So Napoleon are a real good quality, well built barbecue um, and this is sort of the, the lower bracket of the, uh, the Napoleon barbecues that they do, but very high end as well. So with great materials and great features. Um, so as you can see here, we've got the Rogue and this is a three burner. So this is called the 425. They also do a two burner and they also do a four burner. So different amounts of burners. Uh, so depending on how big you want your grill. Uh, we've got a complete black look to it for this year. So as you can see, a nice black, obviously enamel hood, black side shells, black front, black door, all sort of nice and sleek. The black's actually really nice and easy to clean as well. So some stainless steel ones obviously take a bit more polishing, but the black's obviously nice and easy to wipe clean and always looks fairly fresh. Um, so on here we've got a nice big hood, um, so you can be roasting in there different foods and plenty of space for sort of airflow and obviously putting sort of uh, beer canned chickens and different things. So um, obviously we've got, as we open the lid here, we've got the stainless steel handle. We've got a lovely big cooking area in here. So um, we've got a nice big warming rack that can pop out nice and easily. So if you don't tend to use that, you've got an even bigger sort of cooking area. On here, we've got the cast iron cooking grates. So these grates, they, uh, they're, they're really obviously, they hold their heat really well. Um, and they're nice and thick and strong, so they won't break. And um, they've also got the wave technology. So this spreads the heat evenly uh, across the grill. So you get a nice even cook. So, they're really nice and nice for like searing meats as well when they get nice and hot. Um, so you've got two of those in there. You can buy flat plates as well for the grill, which is nice and handy. So if you wanted to do sort of bacon and eggs and different things, uh, sort of, you know, foods that you don't want to fall through the gaps, you've got those. You've then got some really nice stainless steel, uh, heavy duty um, flavorizer bars. So they're nice and strong, good quality. So all your juices will drop onto those. And then in the bottom of this one, as I said, the three burner, we've got some um, sort of twin burners. You've got two sets of uh, holes coming out, so nice and plenty of hot uh, gas and air, uh, heat coming out of those. Um, and they're stainless steel, so obviously built to, to last as well. Uh, and then obviously any other food that drops through, drops through into the, the bottom tray there, and then goes into a little drip tray underneath the barbecue, which we can just pull out and empty nice and easily. One of our favourite um, accessories that comes with the Napoleon grills, or not, sorry, doesn't come with it, but a lot of people buy it with it, is the, uh, the charcoal tray. So you remove your flavoriser bars. We've got this charcoal tray here, so what you do is you load your charcoal up in here, and then you can put some uh, wood chips in here, uh, so, which you have soaked, so you can sort of smoke and cook on charcoal inside your grill. So that just pops inside here on the burners. You can then obviously light your, uh, light your charcoal up using your gas and then you can turn your gas off and then you've got that sort of charcoal taste as well. So it's a bit of a combi grill being able to cook on gas and charcoal. So that's a nice little feature uh, to pop in there. Um, as we obviously going from the front here, we've got the uh, ignition on the turn. So the sort of jet fire ignition. So as you turn and twist, you've got that click where it ignites it and that obviously shoots out obviously the gas and ignites it at the same time so you get a nice clean start every time you're trying to light one of the burners. So turn and hold it there and then obviously you can then control your heat with those. Uh, on the side, well so as you can see I've got it on four wheels so nice, uh, nice and easy to move around on these little wheels just under here, quite nice neat tidy wheels. On the side we've got little, little um, hooks just for your uh, tools and accessories. And then both sides, the side shells fold down. So nice and easy and compact as well. So if you're putting it away for winter or uh, just sort of tucking it somewhere down the side of your house or something like that, it's quite nice to be able to tuck them in. Uh, at the bottom here, we've got our door. So you've obviously got the same, same setup as the doors um, on the three burner and the two burner. And then on the four burner, it's actually twin doors. So, um, but nice solid door, with obviously magnet closing. You've got your uh, hose and regulator under here, which you'd use for your sort of patio gas bottle. Um, so usually the green bottles out there. 
And then uh, there is a space for a um, for your gas bottle in here. Obviously, we don't always recommend putting your gas bottle in here in case it gets too close to the burners. But obviously, that's sort of something made for the sort of American, Canadian, and uh, European market as well. So sometimes the English bottles, uh, British bottles, don't always fit in there. But you can always have that come out of the side or at the back, uh, which is quite nice. So this is the Rogue. They also do the uh, in the sort of 425. They also do an XT version, which is a stainless steel version with like a side burner and a few more features. And then they also do the Rogue Phantom, uh, which is a sort of newer version of, of these. Um, and it's got a lot more features as well. So check out their videos on those ones as well. Um, but yeah, if you've got any more questions, or want to see some more details, check out our website, norwichcamping.co.uk or uh, give us a call. Thanks for watching this video.